our first guest of the day, the CEO of Rumble himself. So great to meet you in person. Matt, likewise, really I mean, excited to be here. It's I've sweet. had the craziest smile on my face for like the past 48 hours. <laughs> what is your life like right now? You know, I'm just thinking about what I got to do here in the next couple of years, but uh, no, focused, super focused. I love um, it. Super excited. Uh, obviously, this is a monumental day and uh, we have a lot of work to do ahead of us, but yeah. uh, super pumped to be here. But I got really good news. You have really good news. I do. I'm gonna, uh, we're, we're gonna invite a special guest okay. to join us. Um, <laughs> uh, and uh, yeah, let's, let's invite him on and then we'll introduce him. A special him. guest? A special guest, yeah. <laughs> no way. Ladies and gentlemen, Steve will do it. Nice it is a pleasure to meet you. Pleasure, pleasure to meet you. We gotta get the wow. mic working, but hold on. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, this could only no, 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 be. No, it's not good. Steve will do it anymore. Well, no, it is. It is. But today, it's, it's something else. Hold on. Let me. Uh... I feel like we have a big announcement yeah, it's, coming it's, momentarily. Uh, this is wild. Steve did it. Steve did it. Steve did it. Did it. All right. <laughs> what? Here. Here. Hold on. All right. Let's yes. Go we gotta get. Is this, is this mic working? I think it is. How's it look? Test. Yeah? All right, the mic's live. Wow. Looks good. You like this? I love the colors, love the look. And I guess, uh, <laughs> is there a big statement you have to make for the world right now? Yeah, hold on. We'll throw that hat on if you want to do it, too. Um, yeah, I'm excited to be on Rumble. I'm excited to um, not be afraid of getting canceled for random reasons. And I'm excited to make videos again, help people and just do my shit and, and um, it's gonna be a, 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 an amazing thing. And I wanna take over Rumble, I really do, so. I think the way you took over other social media, I think you could do exceedingly well. Yes. I mean, on a much smaller scale, I was terminated three times off of YouTube. Yeah. And I talk about stocks, Yeah. like just stocks. I was labeled as harmful and dangerous three separate times. Like that's what they called me. And that's actually how Chris and I started speaking. I cannot imagine the emotional whiplash you went through when just one company, the empire you built, they're like, ah, no more. Just yeah, and it's Thanos for snapped it. That's off of the face of the planet. Thanos snapped, and it wasn't for uh, legitimate reasons. It was for, I, I couldn't, I couldn't tell you why. So yeah. it's 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 nice that I can make videos, do what I love to do, my passion. I can go to bed knowing mm -hmm. that when I wake up, my video is not going to be deleted. And if there's any issues, there's going to be communication. Because um, yeah. that was one thing they didn't do. They didn't communicate. They didn't give a fuck. I mean. I wasn't that surprised when they wouldn't speak with me, but the fact that they didn't talk with you, that just shows no. their company is a company because of the creators. Yeah. And then one of the biggest creators, and then they have no line of communication. We're here oh. talking with the CEO right now. I don't know, <laughs> folks, like none of us uh, are clairvoyant. We can't tell the future, but I am more, I've put my money where my mouth is. I'm betting on the companies that like actually care about the people who make the business work and thrive. And to me, and according to Steve as well, rumble, 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 rumble. I mean, it's, look at this. This is so amazing. I cannot believe this is being announced right here. Well, it's pretty crazy, right? <laughs> Taking over the internet. Well, we're trying it. to right now. Yes. So we got a lot of work ahead of us, yeah. but uh, you know, I, I can't wait to, to show what Steve's gonna do. Yes. Um, when imagine this now he's going to do videos where he is going to be completely authentic he's going to be yeah. real steve all the time because right now let's be let's be fair you have to be careful of what you say you have to you have to be concerned what's going to come out of your mouth you got to like tiptoe around it if you're on youtube you're not authentic anymore yeah you're, you're not being fair to your audience because you're being fake essentially that whereas is... like on rumble you can be completely authentic and i think that's that, that's a really important thing that, that we're pushing right now is authenticity. And uh, having someone like Steve lead the way over here is gonna be uh, pretty fun. So I can't wait for that first video. Yeah. I think we're gonna break the internet with that <laughs> one. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm super excited. I'm super excited just to be able to make videos again. So thank you to Rumble to, for allowing me to be on your platform. Um, it's, it's, it's a beautiful thing, so I'm very I excited. I can right now in real time already see rumbles as like this is going live right now and everyone who is in your following, they're like, finally, we will be able to consume Steve's content once yeah. again. And the thing that's like, okay, there's been times that I've made videos that with the natural language processing at some of the competitors, I'm like, ah, I probably can't say that word. And I, you do mince your words and I'm sure you've been like, I gotta cut out these. If you're saying 
the content we've already seen of you was you holding back. I don't know where this is going to go. Like, does, does the U.S. have the infrastructure in place to be able to handle your unfiltered videos? Uh, this is going to be wild. This it's going to be good. Be wild. <laughs> It's well, gonna be really good. I think you're gonna start seeing more creators because, like, oh, yeah. all the creators out there, they know. Like, yeah. it doesn't matter who you are. If you're a, a huge creator on YouTube, you know you got to be careful, and you're not being authentic. You're yeah. probably not even dropping certain episodes because you're scared what you said in it. Mm -hmm. And like, we all know people that have done that. Like, that's happened. And uh, you know, you don't need to do that on Rumble. You, yeah. you just be you. Like, it, the person you are in your own home, you can be on Rumble, and that is going to make the best content. Yeah. Uh, you, Pretending to be someone else is, is not going to make the best Hardly. stuff. It's yeah, and I'm sure you can even say this with like some of the video. I guarantee the videos that you're most proud of that have been the most successful were probably the ones where you're like, this is just me. This is me having a good time, like not like overly scripted. Like if Rumble is the platform where it allows people to like, you're not like gaming it with the platform. You're like, hey, I'm trying to tell a story, share an episode, like whatever it is. It's so much more authentic. And I honestly think that's why we are seeing a pivot away from let's call it traditional media, to individual people. People trust in people, not corporations. It, it just isn't working. That's the big pivot. I think it's already been going, and I think we're at the hockey stick growth now of a massive switch in media to individuals like you. I agree, yeah. I'm, I'm super excited just to have the, the communication with the platform I work with. You know, yeah. like, you know, I was on YouTube. <laughs> And, you, you know, they wouldn't even give me my 100,000 subscriber plaque. They wouldn't give me my million subscriber plaque. It's like, you know. We so, got a jersey and a hat just for starting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it's we like, got to come up with a good uh, milestone achievement yeah. for, for creators. But it's good just to be, like, in communication with the platform and just mm -hmm. not f feel like a piece of shit to them. Because it's like, yeah. I worked my ass off and it's like, they say, yo, you don't get a million subscriber plaque because of. We, we choose we, we we get to choose who you give, we give it to mm -hmm. so I'm just excited to make videos again and just have that communication with the platform and be a, and, and just not be afraid of getting deleted for stupid political reasons or advertisement reasons you know yeah. just like bullshit reasons you know um, yeah this is, this is going to be amazing yeah I mean I can say and I'm sure you can like already how excited you are so on excited. this side of the camera it's so much more of just the respect of it, understanding that creators are the ones who make the platform yeah. viable as a business. And to feel that respect, obviously you are, I have now for like almost over a year. And I mean, clearly other people have as well. Like we know Russell Brand now just signed, he's doing an exclusive show with on Rumble that you can catch. And that's just one of many. And I mean, well, I'm expecting this to get bigger and bigger and bigger. Well, he's exclusive now too, so. Yeah, exclusive, that, exclusive yeah. Steve will do it videos. Um, I don't know when the first one's uploading, but once it uploads, it's going to be once a week. Steve will do it videos. Wow. My best videos ever. And I'm just super excited because I love what I do, you know? Great. I'm so excited. It, 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 <laughs> you're, see, Matt didn't have no idea you were coming on this morning, but I had no clue. No, you were no very idea. So like, Let's his, go. his reaction this morning oh, was as, as authentic it, as you're going to get. beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's just, to me, and it's cool because it's so it's getting so diverse now so many different forms of content that yeah. the, the average do, person really, out yeah. there is going to find something that they enjoy and resonate with well the last 2 months rumble has exploded in a completely different population and segment of growth like okay. you know we've had a lot of politics i would say in the first year and then that kind of started leaving at the beginning of this year when you joined we saw a lot of the crypto community come on we saw a lot of finance creators and then obviously in the summer um, and now with steve it, it's the it's the gen z like you, awesome. we're we're seeing massive growth in that yeah. segment, and uh, I think that's where you know you could just see like the the amount of the, the viewers going up, subscribers going up. It's wow. it's just been a it, it's been a monumental change in the business in terms of like the audience that uh, that we've seen different habits of, of viewing. It's more like short. Uh, it's not the you know the long political talks. It's like you know getting them. The, it, it's totally different, and that's why we launched the vertical video so you can easily go through. You can go watch it long form basis now on your iOS app, so you can do it both ways. But we're got a lot of work to do, obviously, to to cater to all these different audiences. But I am like, this is the most exciting part is bring someone like Steve onto the platform, um, having him like trailblaze that way and uh, uh, setting set an example of like how how to create good content. And, you yeah. Know, don't don't be fake. Like just get out there and create what you want to create authentically, when and don't hold back. And like 
the stuff you're going to do, like the plans and the works for the type of, type of stuff you're going to do. I think you're going to do some vlogs it's on gonna locals be, as well. Yeah. You're going to be doing. Insane. Yeah, he's going to have a private community on locals, same way okay. you do. Um, he's going to have his channel on Rumble where he'll do, you know, once a week, uh, you know, huge videos. And then, you know, probably some small stuff in between there as well. Yeah, second channel, yeah. daily vlogs. But thing is, I, just, I can go to bed at night and just, and just know, like, my shit's not going to get deleted. And if there's an issue, I'm going to get a phone call, you yeah. know, and we're going to talk it out and figure it out. And um, <laughs> imagine that. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's crazy. It's like these little these little fucking things I'm so excited for. Like, just like yeah. just like being able to put out my content and just know it's not going to get deleted. And just like just just having the communication like to me, like that's like the craziest thing going to because I was I was the biggest one of the biggest YouTubers on the platform zero communication zero they didn't give me my plaques nothing it's like so it's crazy that that's what i'm most excited for is having communication slash <laughs> like being a team with the platform yeah. like hey it, you know youtube could have just told me hey we don't like this we don't like we don't like this we don't like this change that but it's like they were against me yeah and um i don't know why uh it, it beats me but it's um I'm 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 super excited just not to deal with that that bullshit that I I, I can't understand. Yeah, mm -hmm. I uh, kind of going off of that. So I'm not sure if you're aware, but before this big announcement, there over the past year on Rumble, especially in the U.S., there's about a hundred percent year over year growth, mm -hmm. and it's their monthly active users getting to about a hundred million, I believe, earlier this year in the realm of twenty to thirty. So crazy growth just this yeah. calendar year. I think with this type of an announcement so many other people are going to start to say, okay, like, I like that content and I'm going to start putting mine there as well because I think so many people feel the way you do and I do, but what's crazy is that we feel the same way and we're in such distinct forms of content. So this is coming down to just like the human issue of being a creator and dealing with the platform as opposed to like the exact content. Like the fact that we had the same problems and now we're like, hey, no, like we just like being created as a and person. you guys aren't yeah. in politics. Like, yeah, it, not know, in politics at all. At all. So like, and that's, that's what kills me. Everyone's like trying to say, oh, like, you know, Rumble has political content. No, that's not true. Look, we have Steve, we have you. It, 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 it's not true. We're, we're, and that's what we're trying to spirit. On top of that, think about this. People like totally overlook this stat, but 63 million in US and Canada, in the United States, in US, in US and Canada in August yeah. of this year. That's just last month. What did Twitter, the last time they reported MAUs have? 68. That was the last time they reported in the United States. They had 68. We're like, you know, everyone talks so they have like 300 million, but like that's in countries that aren't like as monetizable as the United States. Yeah. So when you look at Rumble, you really got to compare what we've achieved here in the United States uh, to, to these other platforms. YouTube's what, 200 million MAUs, roughly, give or take. Yeah. Rumble is 63, and that's not including our OTT MAUs, that's not including our locals MAUs, and it's also not including the embeds on other sites MAUs. So like, that's just pure app and web. Wow. That's it. So like, you know, I, I think that, I think people don't understand the scale that we've had. We went obviously from 35 million in the US in June to 63 in US and Canada in, in August, which is a huge jump because mm -hmm. of that Gen Z um, dem demo. And now with Steve coming on, I'm not sure what it's gonna look like, but you know, hopefully sooner, by, very soon, we can be uh, bigger than uh, some of these uh, incumbent platforms that are, in my opinion, very inauthentic. I think there's a decent chance, like looking at it from just the stock and the company perspective, one thing that I find to be the most exciting is right now it feels like Rumble is the fish that got through the net before it was squashed out by another big tech play. In the world of stocks, big tech, it's always crushing out competitors that one day could be an issue. And right now the recent news about YouTube, they're fighting with TikTok, like Rumble's in its own lane and when it hits and arguably could be there, critical mass, you can't stop it. The fish is out of the net, it's gone. And I think that's where Rumble's at right now. And it's just gonna get bigger and bigger and bigger. Like so many announcements of well-known people, multiple millions of followers. And then you get this with Steve and I guarantee by the next 24 hours, there's gonna be another pop in Gen Z. I would love to see those analytics. I'm sure they're gonna be just like exploding. <laughs> and then there's gonna be creators signing up of like, hey, no, I gave, platform XYZ an attempt, it didn't work for me, but now they're like, well, I'll give this one an attempt. I'm being told I can be my authentic self. And that's the biggest thing that's it's being missed everywhere. But here, when you're telling people, the CEO right now in real time, 
be yourself. Like, that's it. How do you beat that? How do you beat that as a business model? Like, you don't. You don't. And this is why you're here right now. Yeah, you, you recognize that they can't. You can't beat it. This is. So, do you? I don't know if we can like let the cat out of the bag or anything. Do you have plans, or do you, are you trying to keep it kind of hush hush? Of, like, so you're going to do weekly videos. You're going to have locals, uh, like kind of some vlogs in your own personal community. Yep. Um, is, is there other things you have going, like, or you want to keep it all a little surprise right now? So I'm trying to make just the absolute best content once a week, every every single week, one video, 25 minutes. Uh, Steve will do it videos once a week, but the best content ever, and, and, and it's just beautiful that I don't have to worry about nothing. Like I go to bed and just know I'm not getting deleted, and if there's an issue, I'm gonna get a call, a, a real call, and not, you know, and we yeah. talk it out. And then I'll be doing just daily vlogs, it's my lifestyle, locals, um, the, the, the locals thing, which is like for the subscriptions, just like for the hardcore fans. So there's gonna be a lot of content from me on there, and it's just it's just it's just a beautiful thing. Like it's it's crazy that it's like I'm saying the most beautiful thing is just me being able to go to bed and just know I'm not getting fucking deleted, or <laughs> like it. you know it's like, like where are we so, going? What is happening? I'm so excited about how it got like, here. Like he got new- <laughs> removed. Like is this re- like that's nuts? It's crazy. Yeah. I got I got removed, and it's like every single week I spent a fucking a hundred thousand to a quarter million dollars just helping people out <laughs> literally yeah. for helping people and His then channel was helping people and then it's like i get i get removed for having a, a url you know your url.com of a website that youtube allows on their platform allows you to promote so i just felt like i got targeted i'll be honest with you, I, just, I felt like i got targeted because i have a, a strong fan base that's the youth and i'm not a robot sheep and that's why I got canceled is because I'm just not I'm just myself right like I don't you know and it's pretty crazy that someone that devotes their entire life their life and videos to helping people gets canceled just because I, I don't know is political reasons I don't know I'm not I'm not political but for some some bullshit, that's part of the issues you don't even know I don't even that, know. that's part of the issue I, right I, 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 really, don't I truly even know. don't know because when you get canceled for like yeah. for a URL and it's like, fuck, the website, people must think, oh, the website must be really bad. But it's like, oh, wait. And then, and then you say, oh, YouTube allows you to, to play that website on their platform. And it allows you to, to promote it. It just doesn't make sense to me. So it's like, it just, it really doesn't sit well, well with me. And I just, um, the only thing I can think of is that um, I gave Trump a watch. I don't know. Like... <laughs> We'll find out. Like, but I'm yeah. very, very happy you found a place you're going to be able to flourish. And as soon as it all goes live, I'm sure it'll be happening soon. Be you got your first subscriber right here. Thank so you. I'm excited. It's going to be the best content ever. It's going to be literally the best content ever. Like the best Steve will do it videos ever. And I won't get canceled. So I love you guys. All right. Awesome. All right. Well, so Steve much. did it. That's what we're going to say. Steve, I, Steve, did, Steve did, did do it. Did it. Yeah. Steve did it. All right. I, got, I also got one for you as well, Matt. So rumble. You can... Uh, Take that hey, with you. Matches already yeah. perfectly. There you go. Chris and Rumble. Oh, that is so cool. Nice oh, meeting you, Matt. So cool. <laughs> All right. Yo. Thank you guys so much. All right, let's go have a Congratulations. Train. Thanks, Matt. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks so much. Yep. Wow. Well, folks. <laughs> Here, I don't know if there's a way. I wanted to hang this up, but yes. Now I have my official Rumble jersey. This is wild.